Hey smileys, it's AI and this is AI Brown Smile. Welcome back to my channel for another video. Guys, it's actually pretty late, but I am still gonna do this video because I told myself that I would and I am holding myself accountable for keeping the promises and commitments that I make to myself. So here I am, here we are. Sick of me yet? So welcome back. Um, today's video, okay, so just so you all know, I know the title of the video says that it's a tour of my skincare fridge. However, that's not 100% true because I actually don't have one of the cute little mini skincare fridges that are all the rage right now. But I do keep quite a bit of skincare inside of the fridge. However, it's just a traditional size fridge. So I use two of the shelves in my regular refrigerator for skincare. I've looked at the mini fridges, I've thought about it, I've done my research, like I've looked into them and I just haven't been able to justify purchasing one when my normal, fri when my normal fridge works just fine. Yeah, it's not cute and mini, however, it still does the job. Why buy a mini fridge? I just, I haven't been able to justify that yet especially when I have space in my regular fridge. And trust me, even if I didn't have the space, I would create space for skincare. You better believe it. So um, I am just gonna show you guys some of the skincare products that I do keep in the fridge. So let's run down to the kitchen and get right to it. Hey smileys, hey. Welcome to my awesome and amazing skincare fridge tour. So I have two shelves in the fridge that are specifically for skincare items only. The bottom shelf is where I basically keep the overflow from the top shelf. I store all of my sheet masks in the fridge. Keeping them nice and cool definitely enhances the experience, especially in the hot summer months. As you can see, I have quite a collection of sheet masks. They're the best way to give your skin a treat without breaking the bank, aside from drinking lots of water and taking a lot of deep breaths. These are all by Tony Moly and cost about $4 each. Most of these are made by Korean beauty brands, but not all of them. If you haven't tried any Korean skincare products, a sheet mask is a great way to start if you just wanna get your feet wet. Each mask has ingredients that target different skin types and specific skincare needs. So whether your skin lacks moisture and hydration, needs a deep detox, or a quick pick-me-up after a long night out, there's a mask for that. In 20 minutes, sheet masks allow nourishing, moisturizing, brightening, or age-fighting ingredients to seep in, saturate, and treat the skin. What your skin requires can change from day to day, and I like having options, so I have a lot of sheet masks. These are by Innisfree, which is another Korean skincare brand. They are from their My Real Squeeze mask collection. This one is a rice mask for moisture, and then I also have this Manuka Honey mask, which draws moisture into the skin for a glowy appearance. I also store my lip mask in the fridge, and these, are cooling cucumber eye pads, which are for treating dark circles and puffiness around the eyes. And then of course we have some more sheet masks. These are by Facetory, which is a company that offers fun and effective skincare products who believe every face has a story. Get it? Face story? Facetory? Their everyday sheet mask bundle or collection comes with eight masks. Their products are plant-based and they don't use harsh chemicals, so they're safe for all skin types. The Holler and Glow products are from Target or Tarjay's if you're fancy. I actually haven't tried these pink milk masks yet, but I can't wait to get around to it. And trust me, I have time. Sheet masks do expire, but they have a fairly long shelf life, which is between one and three years. I personally like to use a sheet mask in my skincare routine two to three times a week. They're safe to use every day, but if you have sensitive skin, you should probably use them once a week or only as needed. Using a sheet mask daily would be equivalent or have the same benefits as applying an amazing moisturizer every single day. And they're perfect for girls night. And every girl loves a good girls night. Here, shelf two, I have a few more face masks and by a few, I mean, about 40 more <laughs> I also keep essence and toners 
on this shelf as well as some of my skincare or facial tools. Now we're getting to the good stuff. These face masks are by Maison from the Joyful Time Essence Mask Collection. Skin essence is not a required step in a skincare regimen, but it is definitely an added bonus. Many skin essences help to add an extra layer of hydration and moisture. So if you can throw it in, do so. However, it's important to understand that the use of sheet mask alone cannot and will not improve your skin. I picked up the creme mask, as in creme de la creme, from TJ Maxx. Some of the Korean skincare brands use colorful and creative packaging, which is cute if you're into that. This turmeric mask is a really good one as well. I've used this one several times. Turmeric has a lot of amazing benefits as well. This is a liquid essence and toner by Maison. I like to apply these by pouring it right in my hand and gently tapping it into my skin with my fingertips. Feels so amazing. I have a Witch Hazel Facial Mist by Thayer's. These facial rollers work great along with sheet mask and facial oils to massage the skin. And this is a Gua Sha tool which helps to improve blood circulation and reduce puffiness in the face. This is also a rose quartz gua sha tool, but it is mushroom shaped, which makes it perfect for the area underneath the eyes. Gua sha is a Chinese healing technique that actually dates back centuries. It was originally a body treatment, but it has since been introduced to facial therapies and massages. The technique softens fine lines and wrinkles. It decreases puffiness and inflammation, sculpts facial muscles, and even temporarily tightens the skin, among many other things. Just when you thought it was over, bam, more face mask. <laughs> this is the Superfood Bowl by Tony Moly. It's a pack of their six best-selling face masks, which includes cactus, honey, coconut, green tea, aloe, and peach. I recently added these ice globes to my collection and you can actually use these hot or cold. These are skin food fresh made gel masks which I wear for about 15 minutes and then wash off. They're not meant to be worn overnight. I have a soothing watermelon, toning cranberry, brightening lemon, and hydrating coconut which is really good. And finally, but definitely not least, my Mary Kay soothing eye gel. Okay, somebody stop me. But seriously, remember, skincare is self-care. I said what I said. Happy masking, smileys. Thanks for watching and see you in the next one. Mwah.